Morning guys, Joey from First String Lawn Care here. Uh, welcome to another episode of First String Lawn Care. Uh, if you guys have just uh, come across the channel, uh, if you're just searching, you know, about lawn care and that we just happen to pop up or or however you found us, guys, we're glad you're here. Uh, we'd appreciate if you'd subscribe, give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Guys, our channel is just all about real life and the lawn care business uh, right now. It's, uh, it's a lot about just daily life, you know, just daily what we do uh, me and my helper on a daily basis as we, you know, do these uh, mowing routes, as we do cleanups, um, putting in mulch, anything that we do, we just film it. Uh, Alright guys, today I'd like to give a big shout out to uh, Big Big Sons Lawn Care. Uh, and I believe Big Sons up in uh, Missouri. Uh, if I got that wrong, uh, Big Son, you can comment down below and, and let me know. I think it's in Missouri though. Uh, also, Jeff, Lawn and Landscape, up in Indiana. So, uh, uh, they, uh, Jeff mentioned me in his video uh, yesterday or a couple of days ago, and I just wanted to, to return the favor uh, to those guys. Uh, they always comment back and forth on my channel, and I try to, you know, help them out by doing the same thing on theirs. Uh, two good guys, man. Uh, if, you, uh, if you have time, go check out their channels. Uh, Big Son, he does uh, just a lot of mowing footage. He's uh, got a lot of good stories to tell. Uh, Jeff, Jeff's channel, man, it just, I told him the other day, it just it just relaxes me watching his channel. Just his demeanor is real calm. I just like to watch Jeff. Uh, I can tell that Jeff's a little perfectionist. Uh, sorry about that, guys. Uh, I'm here at the storage unit. You guys leaving back and forth here. Sometimes it makes noise. Uh, but anyway, yeah, Jeff, uh, he showed the inside of his storage unit the other day, and uh, I'm going to do the same here with mine because I told him mine's a wreck right now, but his stuff is all dress, right dress. Uh, so I thought that was kind of cool just seeing how he had his storage unit. And, you know, all of his, his, his hand tools are lined up perfectly in a line and stuff. But uh, if you guys get a chance, go check out Big Son's Lawn Care and Jeff's Lawn uh, and Landscaping. <clears throat> um, Today, guys, this we just got a mowing route. We, uh, like I said, we've got uh, 13 properties to do, maybe 14 if the other one signs up. Um, so, yeah, that's just the footage we'll get today. I'm going to take you inside the uh, storage unit and let you see like what a wreck it is because uh, it's real life here, guys, and you can't keep stuff clean and organized all the time. I do the best I can, but we've had... Uh, uh, a couple of jobs here lately and I you know I kind of just was tired afterwards and I've thrown some stuff just in the storage unit and uh, you know most you know I keep the I keep the trailer you know really looking good inside because it's all organized now and everything that's overflow just goes into the storage unit uh, so I use it for a lot of storage of extra material and uh, sharpening the blades and stuff on the mowers that's really all I use it for now uh, but it's a wreck right now, so uh, I'm going to get off here and go ahead and get started on the day. Uh, I've got uh, a new helper that's coming out and helping me today. It's uh, actually Glenn's brother. He is, he is actually going to be here today, so uh, I'm glad to have the help. Uh, but guys, I'm going to get off here and let's get started. All right, guys. Let's open up this storage unit. <laughs> let's do a challenge. Let's uh, let's do a challenge. How about uh, we do the storage unit challenge? And and everybody that watches this channel. Uh, I challenge you to go to your storage unit or or your garage or wherever and film it just as it is. I know Brian's on maintenance the other day uh, did a truck challenge, a work truck challenge, just to open up the truck and see what's inside. Uh, I want to see what y'all's work storage places look like. So, let's do it. I told you guys it's a mess right now. There we go. Can you see that good? I'm going to move. I'm going to actually take the camera off here. 
and we'll film some of this. All right, guys, we've got. I keep this uh, generator here because that's what gives me light here. We don't have electrical outlets or anything. Uh, usually, I got these cords ran along the side so there's nothing in the way, but I had to move everything the other day. Uh, so we've got some extra bags of mulch. I'm going to take those to a property today. Uh, here we have extra concrete and that's what we use for our uh, lawn care uh, borders lawn care borders <laughs> our flower bed borders uh, extra gas cans that has gas in them that I don't know what to do with because I don't have nowhere to take it these right here I use these uh, these are like little pillows, and they are perfect, guys, <laughs> when you're working on a mower. It saves your knees. I used to keep this stuff up on the shelf. Oh, my God. I, I'm kind of embarrassed how messed up this place is right now. Uh, this is an old fish, fish bait container that I made. Uh, I got my uh, sockets and stuff here. An old cooler that leaks that I need to get rid of. The biggest thing around here is finding somewhere to put your trash. Uh, this trash can is full of stuff that I've had in here forever. Uh, I got all of my hand tools in the truck or in the, in the trailer except for this. These few here. Uh, extra mower blades. Right here is where I sharpen my, my blades. And I usually I usually just keep this out the whole time. Uh, just some extra stuff down here. Got some toast, uh, some straps. Actually, need to take this back to the truck and put it in the toolbox. Uh, water hose. Whenever we do our border installs, we've got extra edging and stuff down here. Don't know if you can see that. Uh, extra rock from our flower bed borders. Uh, over here, some oil chain stuff. Uh, some extra spikes for our lawn care borders. Got some of my tools up here. Tarps. A seed spreader that I don't use. Uh, and this is this right here. This is all paper and plastic from. Uh, from the other day when I got the couple pallets of mulch, I need somewhere to throw that stuff away. Uh, that's boxes from our mulch kits. We've got our two baggers that we don't use no more. We've got extra pine straw here that we got to get to a customer's property. <laughs> a couple of uh, wheelbarrows. My fishing stuff. This was a man. And here's my uh, quick shoot that I took off. But yeah, she's a mess right now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get it cleaned up. Jeff, Jeff's got me, uh, <laughs> Jeff's got me motivated. I'm gonna have to figure something out in here and and s figure out how to keep this thing clean. The first thing I'm gonna do is get all the stuff out here that's got to go to the dump and just bite the bullet and just take it all at one time. The thing is, they want you to separate stuff at the dump, and I just need somewhere where I can go dump it. <laughs> uh, and I don't, I don't want to have to separate everything. But anyway, yeah, that's the inside of the trailer. I mean, not the trailer, but the storage unit. Uh, you all, show me what you got. I'm going to go ahead and get off here, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and grease up these, uh, these trailer axles and... Uh, uh, probably the mowers and get those going. It's been about a week or so since I've done the mowers, so I need to get that done before uh, my help gets here. Guys, let's get to it today.